method to operate the blouse software. To open the blouse software, click on the blouse icon. Now you are seeing the blouse icon BFDTT. It's blouse software icon. B stands for blouse. Now right click the icon. Click in open. After the soft home page appears, click on the order booking. Now the soft home page will be appear in the screen. This is the blouse soft home page. Now click on the order booking part. It's the first option. After clicking the blouse order booking part, you will see the order booking form. In this order form, we can enter the customer name, address, telephone number and after completing all the items click on the save. The customer details will be saved on the record. Then click on the cloth details. It's on the right side bottom. Click on the cloth details. You can enter the cloth details that have been given by the customer. If the customer is giving two types of cloth, you can enter the details of the two types of cloths and you can enter the save for saving the cloth details of the customers you can click on the save after entering all the options now we are entering the measurements that have been taken from the customers height body loose after entering the body loose, you will get the approximate shoulder finishing, front neck height and back neck height. We can change according to the customer choice. Now, after entering all the measurements, click on the save box. Don't let any box empty while saving the measurements. After then, click on the total bill payment, advance paid balance to be paid then save now you can take the customer bill copy also you can take the customer bill copy also now we will see how to take the printout for casual blouse method to take printout for casual blouse after entering all the 10 measurements we can get the required cloth 80 centimeter 90 centimeter according to the measurements click on the basic blouse now you will get the four boxes that's back front sleeve and putty its belt part after clicking the basic blouse you will get the four types four patterns back front sleeve and putty for the customer size it will be created within a fraction of seconds The drawing will be created according to the customer's measurement. After then click on the pictures you will get the printout in the dot matrix printer. Now the back is taken out the printer. It's the back printout. This is the back printout that have been taken in the printer. This is the complete printout back front sleeve and belt part back front and sleeve and belt part in this back part we will get the bottom folding allowance as one and a half inch and then top allowance as half inch will be included in the printout in the front diagram we will get the marks where we should make the dot for the blouses we will get the marks also in the sleeve also we will get the center point of the sleeve side stitching parts of the sleeves the both points should be merged correctly while stitching this is the belt part in the belt part diagram hook side and side will be determined as hook side now the back portion have been cut out this is back portion is have cut out don't let any extra measurements from the lines while cutting now the front part have been cut out
now the sleeve part have been cut out all the side marks should be made out now the belt part have been also cutted belt part have been also be cutted now we are placing the same back front sleeve and belt part in the fabric we can cut out the cloth with that fabric this is the blouse after stitching is the you will not get any loose in the armhole side on the center now we will see the back button blouse method to take print out for back button blouse after entering all the measurements measurements are same for all models of blouses after entering all measurements click on the back button option now you will get the back front sleeve and patty diagrams back front sleeve and patty diagram now after clicking the each part we will get the print out one by one back front sleeve and belt part now we have stitched the front part this is front part there is no hook patty loop patty in the back side only hook patty loop patty this is the finishing blouse in this blouse we as we can see the perfect fitting according to the customer choice method to take print out for katori blouse the measurements are as same as from the normal blouse measurements after entering the measurement click on the katori blouse now the first four parts are basic drawings the last two parts are katori neck part and arm part click the last two boxes you will get the print out like this katori there are two types one is double piece katori and the one is single piece katori this is arm hole side of the katori blouse this is center part of the katori blouse the center part of the katori blouse now the both drawing now this is for double piece katori all the print outs marks cutting marks will be available in the print out cut it along with the marks now this is arm part and the center part this is arm part and the center parts now the katori blouse front part have been finished but method to take close neck blouse after entering all the measurements click on the close neck option you will get the diagrams back front sleeve and belt part patti that is patti now after clicking the each boxes we will get the print out back front sleeve and belt part now is back and front part in the front diagram itself we will get the dot positions where should we make the dots where we should make the dots we will get the positions this is the back part this back part itself we will get the bottom folding point side stitching allowance one and a half inch this is back and front portion after cutting place the part in the fabric and this is the joining shoulder joining method of back and front portions back and front portions now this is the finished close neck blouse now this is finished close neck blouse now this is after stitched close neck blouse model now 
we have stitched the collar now we have stitched the collar in the close neck blouse cutting you can stitch the collar blouse also now method to take print out for princess cut blouse princess cut blouse are two types there are with patti and without patti that is with belt piece and without belt piece after entering all the measurements the measurements are same for as for the normal blouse click the princess cut now you will get the first four are normal basic back front sleeve and patti princess neck part and princess arm part by clicking on both we will get the print out this is front part and arm part this is front and arm part this is front neck side of princess cut the stitching allowances will be given in the diagrams this is arm hole side part this is belt part the belt part for princess cut with patti now he had joined the front portions princess cut with patti blouse the front portion now princess cut without patti now we'll see princess cut without patti click on the last two boxes princess cut neck part and arm part you will get the print out like this get the print out like this in each print out you will get the measurements of the that we have entered this is arm part of the princess cut this is arm part of the princess cut this is neck part of the princess cut this neck part of the princess cut now these are both parts arm part and neck part arm part and neck part now the finished piece of princess cut with side zip finished piece of princess cut with side zip method to take print out for neck designs after opening this after home page click on the option training in this training option you can see what are the neck designs available you can see choose the model as neck catalog choose the model as neck catalog now the catalog designs will be available now the catalog designs will be available these are a fashion date neck models choose the model and in the order booking page enter the back neck design number as 5 click on the neck design option neck design blouse you will get the design number 5 in the back part of the diagram by clicking that you can take the print out in this method this is approximate neck designs you can get the print out like this after taking you can cut the neck design in the paper canvas you can cut the in the paper canvas now we can stitch the neck design in this method the stitching method photos also available now method to take print out for designer blouses there are several type of designer blouses in our software after entering all the measurements click on the option designer blouse click on the option designer blouse the number will ask enter the designer blouse model number enter the model number as 5 or 6 or 7 whatever will the required model now the designer blouse part will be available click on the first box to take the print out for example this is model number 1 to take this model print out we will get the print out 
as this type this is back side and the top is design part this is the design part of that model the training videos will be available to you to how to stitch the each models this is the designer blouse pattern after cutting now we are placing the design in the center as per the mark now the point have been cleared this is model number 4 This is model number 4. This is the printout for this model. By clicking this option, you will get the printout. The training video for stitching this model is available in the software or separate training videos. Now, placing the designs. Placing the design in that model. This is the model blouse. Each model will be calculated according to the customer measurements. Will be calculated according to the customer measurements. Now this is the model number eight, armhole side pattern. All these stitching allowances, half inch for stitching allowance, side is same allowance is 1.5 inch all the marks will be available in the printout so that we can cut and stitch the blouse with perfect this is model number 9 blouse model number 9 to cut this model you can click the option you will get the printout in this manner get the printout in this manner get the printout in this manner now this is back drawing and now is front back design part the back design part now we are placing the design one over another this is the back design shape this is the model number 10 to take this printout simply enter the designer blues model number now we will get the printout in this type get the printout in this type this is the actual back portion actual back portion now you will get the this type of shape whatever will be the customer measurement can take the printout the sleeve models also available in our software sleeve models are also available in our software after entering all the measurements click the option the sleeve design click the option in the sleeve design now the sleeve design page will appear click on the required models you will get the diagram you will get the diagram click the diagram picture you will get the printout example is petal sleeve model to stitch this model you will get the printout in this type this is petal sleeve petal sleeve or fish cut sleeve anything any models now you will get this type of petal sleeve fish cut sleeve any names can be changed according to the customers the center marks and the side stitching points will be available in the printout after cutting the shapes to cut a blouse the computer knowledge is enough to print take a printout basic computer knowledge is enough now 
the petal sleeve then the three four sleeve full sleeve three four sleeve whatever the printout required you can take the printouts this is full sleeve model full sleeve pattern and next is buff sleeve the buff sleeve in the top side only placing the buff in the top side only this is the pattern to stitch that model this is the pattern to stitch that model this is buff sleeve pattern this is cap sleeve you can stitch any mod sleeve models in this software support now we can take the old customer measurements that have been already saved in the system with this method now click on the order booking pay option click on old customer we can search the old customer details with the customer contact number with the customer old order number and with the customer name also by clicking the customer contact number the option will ask the order number also the customer contact number also now we are entering the order number 106 and click on the ok we will get all the customer details that have been already saved that have been already saved in the now we can search with the customer contact number also and the customer name also method to check the saved orders and to delete the entries method to save the orders check the orders click on the order booking details now click on the search by option it's old order number click on the required order number choose the select option <coughs> now click on the order number then click on the show your items will be displayed in the bottom if you want to delete click on the delete box you will option order number for the 104 will be completed deleted method to take old customer measurements to watch the old customer measurements click on the option in the home page measurement details its fourth option click on the measurement details click on search by you can search by option by contact number by order number anything else the same procedure click on order number select the order number click on show then click on delete you will delete the customer details will be deleted now we have entered the new option export you can export the databases in the excel format also now we have deleted all the customer details belonging to 104 all the measurement details belonging to 104 now we have newly introduced the option custom blouse option in this option you can draw your own blouse measurements by entering all the measurements you can check the each measurements of the drawing and you can change according to the requirement click on the custom blues you will get the hand arm hold height front tip distance the present measurements all will be also displayed you can enter the new measurements also method to take check the cloth received details click on the received cloth details it's second option all the search options have been done with the order number or cloth number you can search by order number or 
with the cloth number enter the order number and get on the show the uh, details will be displayed the details will be displayed now click on the delete you will your items will be deleted now you can click and search by the cloth number also and click and search by the cloth numbers also there are management software and cutting software also you can check the amount details for the orders you check the amount details for the orders that have been already paid amount balance amount whatever is the customer's requirement you can check it out this software is completely used for cutting software and basic shop management software for your queries and doubts call us on 8220 4700 54 call for the further clarifications 8220047152